Team Norway, congratulations. Uh, back winning in uh, women relay must be feeling pretty fantastic. And I see some strong team spirit today. Can you tell us about this? No, we, we've always said that we win together and we lose together. And uh, we, Ragnhild has done the glittery thing to this year. So now it's the whole team and we tried to make as many coaches and wax men and people to, to join us. So. Uh, yeah, I think it's going to be every relay <laughs> in the next ones because it's it's working. But it's yeah, it uh, yeah, we're happy and I think the yeah, good energy also makes for good racing. It does look like a nice lucky charm, so you should really t keep it. And um, for yourself, it's not been a very good week last week, uh, but it seems like it's getting better. So how satisfied are you to find the best shape maybe for the relay? Uh, I think it's. Uh, my shooting has been good, so I've always had that confidence, but the, the physical and the skiing has been difficult, so I think it's starting to turn around, and I was nervous, of course, but uh, at least when it's a bit icy in the morning today, so uh, I think it was uh, it's pretty good, it's getting better, and I think it's, I'm looking forward to the next week, and it's still only halfway through the season, and uh, I think it's, you can't be in good shape all, all year, so or I can't. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to just, just uh, trying to get better for every week and uh, looking forward to race. Thanks, congratulations and best of luck with that. Marte, welcome back in the relay. Welcome back on top of the podium. So yeah. first thing is, like, how does it feel? Really good. I uh, should wear this all day <laughs> now, so I'm really happy. <laughs> you really brought the team in the leading spot, uh, clean shooting, fast skiing. It really looked like a vintage Marte. What, did it feel also like this? Vintage Marte, I like it. <laughs> yeah, but I, I agree. <laughs> I felt like myself again and it was hard to, to start the season so late uh, in Pukluka and I, the sprint was tough and the pursuit was a bit better and the 15k was a bit better and today it, uh, I felt like the old days so um, it was so fun to race with the team again and the team spirit and today I think it was a team effort not just the athletes but uh, the trainers and uh, the wax team and we had amazing skis and it was, uh, it was a really good day for Norway. As you said, it's been uh, quite tough to start so late. Uh, did you expect that maybe the form was uh, coming so quickly? No, <laughs> uh, I didn't. Um, so I'm a bit shocked. <laughs> but um, the relay, it's not so... It's a really short distance, so I think that's, that's good for me. <laughs> uh, and we will see what will happen uh, the next days and in uh, Antols and everything before uh, Oberhof, so I'm really excited. We are too. Congratulations and best of luck. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Team Germany, congratulations on the podium, on the home ground. I will start with you, Vanessa. This was probably one of the best performances from you this season. So how happy and satisfied and proud of yourself today? I'm really happy with my performance uh, in the track and also on the shooting range. It was uh, yeah, such a great race. Um, my starting position was not uh, not the best one, but I tried to focus on myself and uh, push really hard from the first meters. We know you as a great shooter. Today you skied really strong. Does the support of the crowd help you find the energy to, to push even harder maybe? Yeah, of course. It's great to um, go di directly uh, in, yeah, off the fence uh, going and this is uh, what I what I want. Uh, that it's all so loud, and I can focus on myself, but uh, push really hard. Congratulations, Denise! Uh, you really had to bring this one home for the team in front of the home stadium. So, what did you think? How did you feel out there? Yeah, it was an amazing fight, especially with Doro. Yeah, all the time when you are together with her on the shooting range, the most of the time you're looking not so good against her. But um, yeah, you have to stay by yourself. And the girls in front of me did a great job, and I was totally in touch of the top of the you know, the other relays. And yeah, it was amazing. But you have to stay by your own and make your own race. But we are on the hunt a bit today, and sometimes when you come a bit more on the defensive situation. Sometimes it's easier and you have just the choice to, uh, to keep going and to uh, 
full focus on in front of you and yeah we did it and yeah, in front of our home crowd it's amazing. It's becoming a bit of a classic, you against Doro in the relays here in Ruppolding, no? Yeah, maybe, and also Lena, <laughs> all the time the same athletes against <laughs> each other. And uh, you, you really look super strong on the skis. Uh, how satisfied are you with the form? It seems like the ski form is uh, coming stronger and stronger, coming Hoberhof maybe. Yeah, I feel comfortable now. The most important thing is to stay healthy and also the next weeks to make no risk and to stay calm and relaxed and make a good preparation and also for the mind and also for the body that you get a good rest after this trimester. But I think we have a good plan for the team also and then we are hopefully a full in focus and full and good energy in front, uh, in front of our home world champs. It looks likely. Congratulations. Really strong performance. Thank you. Thank you. Team Italy, congratulations. Uh, it's another podium in the women relay. Very strong team performance. Uh, we'll start with you, Samuela. You started the relay. Uh, it looked quite a battle out there to, to really try to keep the lead. Yes, I'm really happy and uh, I like the first, uh, the first uh, start. So I'm uh, really happy and uh, yes, the race was good. It's a clean shooting, uh, but uh, also pretty solid on the running time. Uh, what was your focus during the, the leg today? Uh, just to yes, keep focus on uh, what I was, I was doing. And uh, yes, I'm happy. It's a good start of the new year as well, but a solid season overall. Uh, how are you feeling? Uh, so some good top 30 results coming almost every week now. Yeah, uh, it's not uh, so easy, uh, but uh, we try to do the best for the season. Congratulations. Rebecca, it's uh, uh, back in the relay. You didn't compete in the individual. Uh, was it the plan to rest and uh, be completely healthy and uh, full attack today? Yeah, it was the plan that I do the relay and then I go to Antolz and to have a good shape there. <laughs> And so it was a good plan for the for, for us. How satisfied are you with the performance today? It was a very fast standing shooting and uh, solid in the prone. Yeah, it, um, I saw the French before me and they missed it. So I do my thing, my fast series, and then I go on the last lap. Next week we are in Antols, it's your hometown. What's the feeling to be competing uh, on the home? It's my first time that I compete there. It's really nice and um, I'm I think I'm really nervous. But it would also be a great time, I think. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you, thank you.